Yeah, praise the Lord and good morning wherever you are. Bwana Yesu asifiwe sana. It is a beautiful Thursday morning and I thank the Lord because of his goodness, because of his faithfulness. And uh, my name is Julius Kuyoni. I'm born again. I love Jesus so much as my personal savior. And the Lord has put my heart something that I want to share this morning. And I've just posted in my Facebook page and uh, I bless the Lord because he's a faithful God. And uh, this morning the Lord has given me something, a powerful word in the book of Romans chapter 5 verse 5. And it talks about hope, hope, our hope in Christ Jesus, that the Lord has poured his love through his spirit to our hearts. And this morning I'm thinking of uh, very many hopeful people. People are hoping to get so many things. People are hoping even in the political arena. People have a lot of hopes in their political parties. People have a lot of hope in the business deals. People have hope someone told you that he's going to marry you or you're going to marry him. And uh, there are so many hopes that uh, people are giving out. But when I read uh, a letter of Apostle Paul to the church of uh, Romans in chapter 5, uh, verse 5, he said uh, that uh, this hope does not disappoint. In NIV version, the Bible says that uh, and this hope does not, you know, put us to shame. And this morning, I want to share to somebody that there is hope in Christ Jesus. And our hope in the Lord is not like, uh, you know, the hopes we get from people. Because people, uh, moreover, in most cases, they change. People, in most cases, you know, uh, from what they told you yesterday, you see them today, they say, they speak different things. But I thank the Lord because He is a faithful God. And that is why Apostle Paul told the Roman church that uh, this hope does not disappoint. I want to encourage you today, as you face today, as you face so many things ahead of you, remember that this hope does not disappoint. Katika jina la Yesu. Tuna matumaini katika bwana Na bibili nasema matumaini haya. Hayata tuwaibisha. Umeaibisho marangapi na marafiki. Umeaibisho marangapi na biashara. Umeaibisho marangapi na wale ambao na waamini watakusaidia sana. Hata familia yako inaweza kukuangusha. But I want to tell somebody today as you face this morning. Jua ya kwamba kuna mungu ambayo kieka matumaini kwake hawezi kukuaibisha. Kuna mmoja ambaya natumainika Yesu Kristo mwana wa mungu amekufa msalabani kwa sababu yangu na yako Acha ni kuambie Kuna mengi ambayo utaezaika matumaini yako kwazo Lakini in one way or another Kuna vile tu watakuangusha Lakini na kupatia matumaini ya rafiki asie kukuangusha Yeye ni Kristo Yesu Biblia nasema yeyote atakai muamini Hawezi ya kapotea Whoever believes in him shall not perish. Whoever, it doesn't matter. It does not, you know, you, you, you don't, you don't, you don't, you don't need a comment. You, you, you don't need some supportive documents before Christ. It's, he just need your heart. Give him your heart today. Pray this short prayer and say, Lord Jesus Christ, I thank you for this morning. Lead me, Jehovah, as I start my day. Show me your way. Show me your love. Protect me. I lean on your hope. Your hope does not disappoint. Thank you, Holy Spirit of God. Romans 5.5. 5. And this hope shall not disappoint. I'm telling you there is a friend that when you put your hopes in him, he will, he shall never disappoint you. His name is Christ Jesus. That the same apostle Paul says that I am not ashamed of the gospel for it is the power that bringeth salvation to all that believeth in him. This morning my brother, if you want anything to succeed, please place it in the hands of the Lord for this hope does not disappoint. May the Lord bless you so much. I speak a blessed day ahead of you in Jesus name. You are traveling far and wide. You are within your premises. You are staying indoors. May this hope revive you once again. 
and finally perhaps i'm talking to you and you feel discouraged you feel hopeless you feel like not trying again you remember the guys the, the, these disciples the fishermen who were fishing the whole night but the bible says that uh, by early in the morning when jesus came they got nothing but jesus said once again throw your nets unto the shore throw your nets to the sea and the bible says when they accepted that is the time they received what belongs to them maybe you tried yesterday maybe you tried uh, you know uh, ulitaka kuolewa maybe ulitaka kuoa maybe ulitaka kuanza biashara ukaogopa ukaona mambo mengi magumu lakini asubuhi ya leo ni natangazo nina ujumbe kwako ya kwamba kuna rafiki mmoja ambaye anasema rudia tena you open a shop ukafunga you open a, a salon ikafungika you, you tried so many things you applied for many jobs this morning i'm telling you the word of god is saying this hope does not disappoint so throw your nets once again wake up from your bed move walk get to the streets get to the shamba get to the business place and begin proclaiming the love of God begin proclaiming the hopes in Christ Jesus because he's right there to assist you may the lord bless you have a blessed day have a wonderful day in Jesus mighty name amen my name is Julius Kuyoni god bless you